How's it going, ladies and bruises? I'm Bobby Six Killer, and welcome back to Tim Tim. We're still heading to Arasola. Um, we're getting a little bit hurt out there, but I think we'll make it. Wake up, you. We have company. Huh? What? You're ready to be beaten by both of us. Shut up and follow my lead. Let's see your Tim Tim, stranger. Um, we got our first evolution last time, too. Our swaddle or whatever evolved. So I get some of them confused with their Pokemon equivalents, but you know. No biggie. What beats nature? Fire and the darkness. Alright. I'm really hoping my Kaku evolves soon. I think it would be awesome if it evolved. Oh, it might be that weird flying thing I see around. I don't like that as much. I might just switch to my butterfly then, if that's the case. We'll see what happens. Not willing to call it just yet. Down you go. I mean, we gotta catch them all, right? Gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the saying for Tim Tim, right? That's the Tim Tim thing. Gotta catch them all, Tim Tim. Something like that, anyway. Uh, 14. You pick that one and you go into that one hard. Poison, that sucks. Nice, got some level ups. That's how we do. Pukey. I still like Pukey. I like how dopey it looks. I really like dopey stuff. That's how I get away with being myself, because I like my own dopiness. Um. <laughs> Boom. That should do it. Yeah, nice. Now that is how we should be doing it. Now I'm starting to get to know uh, what types everything is. Well, some of them you can infer anyway, but you know, it's not fair. <sighs> There's so much to explore. The areas are huge. Huge. There's not a hell of a lot there, but they're huge. There's someone to talk to. Who are you? Daedalus. Hello, stranger. What brings you here? It's passing through. On your way to Arasola, probably. Carry on, then. My business isn't all that interesting for you. Breathtaking, are they? Sometimes sit here for hours. I wonder if this is how the high above us look down on us. How small and insignificant we must look from there. Anyway, I'm interested in changes of perspective. This little high angle view we have here is just a waste of what it must be to look... Must be like to look from high above. Of course, I'm not crazy enough to plan anything regarding the high above. Don't worry. I just want to see how we can understand their perspective. Suppose we could see our little Denise from above the clouds. So of course I've thought of hiring an airship to take pictures. That'd be way too expensive and I'm just a gifted amateur with intellectual curiosity. But you, you could help. How? You're a tamer, aren't you? You could use properly trained flying Tim Tim. You need Tim Tim strong enough to carry a camera and well trained to get us the shots we want. You think you could help with this? I'll give you a little reward for your trouble. Sure. Let's take a look at your Timpedia and see what birdie might do the job. Let me take a look at your Timpedia. Maybe this one. No, better this one. Yeah, this is the one. Bring me this one. Banshee. Yeah, it's right what we need. Strong but also intelligent. We needed to follow instructions with complete accuracy. Not just fly high. Give me a Banshee. What is a Banshee? I've never heard of that one. Guess we're gonna have to find out. Oh, didn't see you there. Good day, fellow tamer. I've never seen you around these parts. First time on this trail? How are you liking the Thalassian Cliffs? They're lovely, aren't they? The best antidote for city life. So let's enjoy them to the fullest, eh? Let's do some fighting. You know how to enjoy your time. Just one? And it's the duck guy again? I hate the duck guy. <laughs> I really do. Would you go away, duck guy? Holy balls! 
That was so weak. That seemed to do a hundred damage. What the crap tastic killer? That was bullshit. Let's give him a pick. It's level 18. That's terrifying. Eighteen's very high. I'm not used to things that strong around here. Or at all, ever. Come on, butterfly. No, 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 no. God damn it. Oh, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> God damn, we've nearly got nothing left. I need somewhere to rest. Which does more? 37, 20. Go nibble. Just in case, you never know. Here's poison, which is nice. Double level ups. That's always good. Ah, you got me. Well done, fellow tamer. Jeez, you shouldn't be hanging around here with a level 18 critter. That's kind of bullshit, hanging around here with that. Trying to pick on the newbies, huh? One bomb plus. Ooh. Sorry. Maybe that thing evolves into a Banshee. One Ether Plus. Yes. Wah! Indeed. <laughs> That's what I like to say. Is this a town? This is a town. Sweet! We just need a place to heal. What is this? Is this the place to heal? The Dojo of Arisola. This is not the place to heal. This is it. Healy healy. Thank god. Barely survived out there. Does that automatically fill up our um thing as well? I assume that automatically fills it up. I kind of want to switch out. I'm thinking of taking Kaku out of the team to be honest, but uh, Pahiro I'll probably take out as well. Let's take Pahiro out. Swap for Genki. I like Genki. I'm pretty down with Genki. I do feel like we need to go and catch some more stuff that we haven't got yet. I imagine there's a crap load we've missed so far. Hey, let's play Team Team. Where are your Team Team? Dad says I'm too young for Team Team, so I pretend to be a Team Team. You can play with me, but only if you know your Team Team very well. Okay. Look! Now I'm a Tartaru. Can you see me? Uh, of course. Oh, what a great team team you are. You're so tall. Yes, look, I can see over everyone's head. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Blam. Look now. I'm a lowly. Now, flit, flit. Um, wow, so powerful. You have no idea what a lowly looks like, right? It's the butterfly. You jerk. So fast. Yes. Oh, I'm flying very fast. I can see the other side of the river from here. Nobody can catch me. And now you. Watch me. I'm transforming into a lowly. Not allowed to repeat Team Teams. Look, I'm a Kalazu. Oh. What's a Kalazu? Beware my tentacles. Oh, yeah. Another one. Another one. <laughs> You're enjoying that too much. Okay, so now I have a sword and we're fencing. Defend yourself, Saipat. I'll beat you with my... Tanto? God damn it. I don't know enough about them. Meet you with my Psy. Oh no, you won Psy Pet. That was fun. You're pretty cool for a grown up. Here, you can have my kiwi. I don't like them. <laughs> kiwi fruit. I love kiwi fruit. Alright, let's talk to this guy. Sorry, Tamer, but the dojo's closed. You can't come in. I'm here to see Sophia. She's not in. That's why we're closed until she comes back. It's not unusual for her to take some time off, but not that long. Where is Sophia? She said she was going to catch some Tim Tim and around Windward Fort. She took her surfboard, so there's no reason why she's gone so long. With the board, you don't have to come back the long way. Through the gifted bridges, you can just surf your way out of Windward Fort through the Solaro River. I'll find her. Would you do that, fellow Tamer? Thank you. I'd feel much better if someone looked, took care of this. But can I find her again? Sophia is supposed to be surfing near Windward Fort. If you have a surfboard, it's easy to find. Just get in the water and... I don't have a board. Then it's the scenic route for you. Leave Arisola and go north. You'll have to go through gifted bridges. It's a long way, but there's no getting lost. Windward Fort's right at the end of it. God damn it. 
I think what we need to do is go and catch a bunch of new Team Team that we haven't got already. Because... Oh, we got a, a mission over here. Because I feel like we must have missed crap loads by now. So we only have seven in the whole game already. I'm sorry, but the tour hasn't started yet. Please wait at the meeting point and the guide will meet you there soon. I'm the guide. Six killer. You? Wasn't it supposed to be? Never mind, it's cool. You'll do. I'll do my best. Sure, sure. Listen up now. Oh, Sen Kalazu. So, how well do you know Denez? Think you could explain the main sites and answer their questions? I could try. Yes, thank you. The group's over there. Just go and give them a tour. I don't know. Improvise. Pretty please? We're waiting for our guide. That's me. Hey, hey guys. The guide's finally here. Listen up. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Um, Arasola, the biggest city in Denise? It was described for the first time by the ancient poet... I don't know. Ariadne of Arasola? That's what it says in my guidebook. How am I meant to know the answers to these? Phaedra of Zadar? No. Pasiphae of Turkisa. She wrote about its unique location halfway between water and wind. Fascinating, what a city. The majestic massif of red rock you can see towards the south on the way to Brickle Damar is called uh, the Thalassian Cliffs. They descend all the way to the shore of the Solaro River. Excuse me, just one question. What's on the other side of the river? The town of Turkisa. A quite little town that boasts the ancient ravine fellowship. The last of the sailor brotherhoods of old. Alright, one last question. What do you recommend we visit next? I'm really into history. The ruins of Woodward Fort? Oh, castles. I love castles. Well, we'll see if it has something to do with the one in Loch Adois. Enjoy the rest of your stay. I'm so ready to get back to the hotel. I'm beat. Did I do it? Are we good now? You did it. Thank you so much. Now, just to herd them to the hotel and be done for the day. You've earned your rank insignia as a true and honourable tour guide. Umbrella. Damage taken from water techniques is reduced by 20%. We're proudly six killer. Gear items. Each team team can have a piece of gear equipped, and each piece of gear has a unique effect. What? You can armor the team team? That's crazy. I didn't know that. I need to organize my team. We want to protect from water. None of these are really ones that I really need to protect from water specifically. But, uh, yeah. This place is freaking huge. Alright, so instead of heading north like we meant to, I think I'm going to go and try and find some Team Team we don't already have. We need to increase our collection. Look, we don't have this piggy pick. Let's catch some stuff. Try not to kill it. Oh, they have genders as well. I didn't notice that. Does that mean you can breed them as well? Like in Pokemon? I do like breeding them. Uh, Team Cat. We have so many of those. Put your shield up just in case. Come, piggy. Friendship. Immune to allies' offensive techniques. That's good. That's a wind type? I had no idea that was a wind type. Wouldn't have guessed that. Wind blade. Ooh, nice. Lashing gales like the frozen Tramotane. Wind howling over the lock. 40 damage, 9 stamina, 2 priority. That's pretty cool. We must have evolutions coming up soon, right? Oh, I haven't been over here, have I? I forgot about that. What now? Can't an old lady enjoy some quiet time on her own? You came to me. Chill out. You young punks have no respect. Well, do you think you can take this old girl on a Tim Tim battle? Of course you do. I'll teach you some manners. Have at your Tim Tim, youngin. Oh, I'll show you. You want to tussle with the muscle? Look at my adorable Tim Tim and quiver with fear. Their adorableness knows no bounds. God, they're level 14. That's quite scary. 
I'm gonna get rid of the piggy pig. Kill the piggy pig before it does that bamboozle thing that really sucks. <laughs> God damn, they're pretty tough. Alright, that's fine. Hit him again. At least we get tons of XP from this, right? Maybe Crystal will evolve soon. If it's anything like normal Pokemon, then starters what evolve at level 16 usually. So he's getting there, you know. Should we go with the Windblade? Slightly lower damage. I don't know if you get a stab bonus, though. Ah, oh, crap. He's out of energy. I didn't see that. That was a mistake. Dead. Toxic Farewell. That's an awesome ability. Let's bring Ganky in. Because Ganky's such a low level. This thing's about to go down. I think. <laughs> I hope. Oh no. Survival! Oh dear, that was quite the absolute defeat for me, was it not? I concede, Young Tamer. As well you should. Now I'm gonna go catch some stuff and leave me the hell alone. Who's this one? Welcome to Paharo Drop. The best place to catch Wind Temtem. And all that. Just watch your step, it's quite the fall. What's down there? A long way to a quick end. I mean, there is a chance you might survive, I guess, if you're lucky enough to land on water in Upper Indigo Lake. But don't even think about trying. Better be safe. Keep your feet on firm land and have some Tim Tim battles. Way safer. Let's fight. Then I guess I'll go heal. And then we can come catch some more stuff. That was the intention and I ended up in fights again. These ones are only level 6 though. These ones are little baby ones. Oh, there we go. There's a bigger one. Oh, at least pick this one off first. Even the low level ones can do a bit of damage. Which makes them worth getting rid of. Incoming! Ow. You hurt my feelings. Gonna take some knocking out this one. I know, I know. He's probably not gonna survive very long, but uh, this thing's weak to electricity, right? Take advantage of that. Woo wee, that was nice. Oh, it nearly killed itself. Ganky, what a beast. I'm glad I added you to the team, Jesus. <laughs> you turned out to be a pretty good addition. Wow, you beat me, what a paha rack. Sure. What a paha rack, I guess. Give me something wild. Go. Wild thing. Go. I choose you. There we go. Aw. Not a piggy pig.
keep picking them down. Oh crap. I hate that move. That move sucks. Makes him completely invincible for one turn. Well, after he gets to use it, that is. We're just gonna go heal before we try and find something else to catch. Because we're getting pretty hurt out there. A little lightning thing's pretty cool though. I bring the pig in, but we've already got like three flying types in our team. We got the butterfly, the bird. We got two birds. Two birds, one butterfly, and the the bug lightning bug thing. That's four. We got four flying types. Holy crap. Well anyway. Let's see what we can find in here. Aha! We don't have one of those yet. We need to pull Crystal out though, I remember what happened last time. I have no idea what type they are. So I guess we'll find out. That doesn't do very much. Curious enough, Windblade's gonna work. That's neutral. Ow, uh... He just healed his ally. He's probably lucky because he would have died otherwise by the look of it. Capture this guy. Excellent. Not a fan, really, to be honest, but, uh... You know, we gotta catch whatever we can find. Gotta catch them all, you know? They want us to head north. We're not finding much new stuff around here. To be honest, we found, what, the pig, which isn't super new anyway, and the skunk, well, the, the rat thing. I don't know what it, what it is, but you know the thing. This thing. Hey there, friend. Are you heading for the Gift of Bridges? Before you do, I have, do you have a map of the Gift of Bridges? No, but I have a Timessence file. Well, relax, man. I was just asking whether you have a map. No problem if you don't. Oh, okay. Phew. Gee, people are so on edge these days. Like, I'm here just to give you, I don't know, quests or something? Like, chill, dude. So, what's difficult about Gifted Bridges? You won't get lost, that much is for sure, but there are plenty of wild Temtem -tem lurking in the grass, and sometimes the non Temtem -tem fauna can be pests, if you catch my drift. It's the usual route for tamers going to the Windward Fort. Sometimes they get overexcited and jump at the slightest chance to have a Temtem -tem battle, so you've been warned. Enjoy the outdoors. Right, let's head on. Here comes a new tamer, fresh from the dojo. But for we're fresh from the dojo too. Shh, silence! We'll challenge you, stranger. Oh man. <laughs> Dude, you'll be fine, don't worry. Don't panic. I like the tiny narwhal. I hope that evolves into something that looks more awesome than what it is right now. You know what I mean? I'm hoping that gets more awesome. What does Sparks do? Boost Special Attack, okay. And we can boost Speed too. They've got four Team Team though, that's quite a lot. Double damage. Don't like that. It's not very nice. Swally, okay. I can live with that. Keep double teaming. 
DC beam. That's so cool. I hope that evolves into something really sweet looking. So bugs and grass types... In Pokemon bug and grass type are separate. In this, they're one thing. Kind of like in the Pokemon card game. Crystal Dust is going to hurt him. Oh shit, that was a mistake! I didn't notice that, my bad. That was, that was bad. I'm sorry. I should have paid attention. Boom. Nice! Man, that wrecks shop. Go in front of the glass blade and then go wind blade on this one then. That's better. Lots of blades. All the blades, all the time. Swally goes down. One more? Man, Genki is leveling fast. Told you. Ugh. Genki's catching up real fast. Whoa, look at that thing. Dude. That was another person's thing, but it was awesome. Aw. You guys are boring. You're like... You like Pidgeys. No Pidgeys. I don't want Pidgeys. Go away. Annihilate him. Oh, come on. Really? He survived? That's bullshit. He should not have survived that. He should have been insta killed. No, not Crystal Dust. That's a waste. Little bit of XP, can't complain I guess. Better than nothing. Gonna poke in the eye with a pointed stick. Good day sir, did you care for a team team battle to pass the time? It's a long way. I'd love to fight you. We'd love to fight you. <laughs> Your friend's uh, the quiet type, huh? That is the evolved form of uh, Kaku, because it's called Saku. Oh, that's disappointing to look at, man. I'm very disappointed by it. I don't mind telling you. My disappointment knows no bounds. Ow. No slappy. No splappy boom blappy. Ooh, that one's pretty tough. a little bit worrying. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, come on. Go down, man. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, botanophobia. We need to get rid of that. That makes them very not that useful. My god, they just took out our whole team. Son of a bitch. Go nature types! Does that mean Kaku evolves at 13? Because this Saku's level 13. I guess it doesn't necessarily mean anything, right? Who knows? Down you go. Owies. I guess... Yes, it is. The evolution's very cool. Aww. That's such a disappointing critter to look at. I keep going to call them Pokemon. I know it's not a Pokemon. Not so fortunate after all, huh? <laughs> I know it's not a Pokemon.
but it's very hard. Welcome to Gift of Bridges, dear traveller. Although there's not much bridge left, these are still majestic if you think about it. Bridges? Yes, I know, they might not look like it, but these were once mighty stone bridges. Of course, they collapsed a long time ago, and what you see nowadays is less impressive. There's still a bit of proper bridge near Windward Fort. The fact that it's still standing is a testament to the talent of the builders. Safe travels and watch your steps. Some stones are a bit loose. I can imagine. Well, unfortunately we're out of time. We need to wrap this one up. And we keep running into these useless bloody things. They're pretty underwhelming. These Paharos are everywhere, man. They're like, they're like Pidgeys, except even more prevalent than Pidgeys. <laughs> they're like super Pidgeys. Go Shrill Voice. That's a real handy move, man. Wish my lightning bug thing wasn't weak to grass types for no particular reason except that's just how it how I rolled the dice. That's really unfortunate. You can roll a weak an extra weakness. Not a fan. Not a fan of the extra weakness. Wonder when this toucan evolves. If and when it evolves. Hey, come here. Look at this team team I just caught. I bet you can't beat me if I use this one. Only one way to find out. Team team up. Alright, we'll do this fight and then we'll wrap it up. Ooh, what is this? <laughs> is that a, the evolved form of that narwhal thing? It's like a flying cloud narwhal. I love it. <laughs> Why are there so many flying types, for Christ's sake? Whiplump. Ice cubes. Interesting. There we go, double damage. Alright, you need to swap out. I don't like having you in here. Let's put Tataru in. Could be some free XP for him. I have no idea what that evolves into. I don't think I've ever seen the evolve form of it. Might never either, depending on how hard he focuses on him. Okay, he just, he maimed him. He just went in. I was like, look, a weak one. Let's go in. <laughs> Mess him up. Wind burst. Nice. What does this do? A terrifying gust of wind capable of throwing a small airship off course. 90 damage, 12 stamina. I think I prefer that to Feather Gatling, which is 100 damage with 17 stamina. But then we've already got Wind Blade, which is... Uh, well, 40 damage, 9 stamina. I don't know, man. I think I'll get rid of Feather Gatling. I can't see myself using it, to be honest. It's just too costly. How did you do that? I thought this Tim Tim was invincible. How can you think that if you just got the bloody thing? Okay, okay, there's a lot of extra area here. Oh my god, alright, well I'm gonna do a little bit of grinding between the episodes, so I might have some new Tim Tim, and some might evolve, I don't know really. Um, we'll see, but I won't progress the story, you know. Between episodes, if you are playing, um, look out for me in the game. Come say hi, come join up. It'd be cool, It'd be cool. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. We're gonna leave it here, because I'm sick of fighting these bloody Paharos anyway. Thanks for watching, thanks for hanging out with me, and I'll see you in the next one.